Water is pretty amazing. Two thirds of the earth is covered by it. We swim in it, drink it, water our plants with it, and industry depends on it. We use it every day and can't live without it. But we rarely stop to think about how special water really is. To better understand this exceptional compound, a good place to start is down here, deep beneath the surface of the earth. Follow me. These caves and formations were sculpted by water, the same substance that's at work in the oceans, in the air, and in our bodies. Water chemistry is really about solutions, one compound dissolved in another. For instance, this pool is a solution of minerals from rocks dissolved in water. Cave formations are made from these minerals. Every solution is made up of at least two components. One is a dissolving medium called the solvent. The other is a substance dissolved in the solvent called the solute. In this case, the solvent is water. The solutes are the minerals dissolved in the water. Solutions that have water as the solvent have a specific name, aqueous solutions. Seawater is a solution of thousands of compounds in water. One solute, which gives seawater a salty taste, is sodium chloride. Almost all the minerals found on land can also be found dissolved in seawater. As we explore the chemistry of water and solutions, you'll find out how this cave was formed, why soft drinks fizz, why some solutions like battery acid conduct electricity, why soap cleans things that plain water won't clean, and how to make a stream of water bend. 